Welcome to Business Live. I'm Mark Crossgrey in BL tonight. So with Iron Rock Insurance here, uh, the results which came out recently, we carried them on Business Live. Weren't fantastic results, you know, for the last quarter. So it is awesome. Very good to see a director buying up some shares here. Skin in the game, it gives us some confidence, you know, as analysts or being in the market. And if you're a shareholder in Iron Rock, better known as The Rock in terms of their ticker symbol. So a director, you know, buying up 45,333 shares uh, on August 18th, 2020, just the other day. So we're gonna see how Iron Rock does, you know, for the rest of the calendar year. Next up, we got Blue Power, you know, uh, BPOW. And kudos to them. So their ticker symbol, BPOW. And why are we congratulating them? Nice, you know, annual general uh, meeting booklet or AGM booklet. And this is for their AGM, uh, you know, notice, their annual general meeting, which is coming up. Now we spoke about this for Panjam Investments recently as well. So for Blue Power, they're giving you like an 11 page booklet here. You can log on to jamstockx.com, the JSC website, download it, read it before the AGM. Now the AGM is gonna be September 14th um, at actually Hope Zoo uh, at 4 p.m. And it's a great location. Now Mayberry Jamaican Equities, and don't mix it up with a securities dealer. This is MJE in terms of ticker symbol. Now, this is a publication of their you know, net asset value daily as of August 17th, 2020. Now rallying, really jumping up, almost $9 Jamaican again. So $8.82. Now Epley Caribbean Property Fund, don't get it mixed up with Epley Limited, you know, the financing company and so forth, you know, or the credit investment company. So they've bought back a total of 168,408 shares or units it's been bought back during the period august 4th to august 12th some nice volumes here you know they're actually being successful with this buyback program and they make it very clear very transparent nice release here that they've done this you know through the open market via stockbroker ncb capital markets now last up overseas markets now american airlines coming out with a harsh release here saying it might have to cut up to 700 flights you know in the us by middle of october let's say october so this really makes you know the profit the businessman the globe trotting investor buffett seem like he's right about the airlines stock price really kind of pulling back to 12 dollars and change again 12 dollars 80 or so and you know just talking about uh, um, not just the 700 flights but american airlines looking to maybe suspend flights to 15 u.s cities and it all boils down to a big thing they've gotten 5.8 you know, you're talking a billion dollars already, you know, for payroll support into American Airlines folks. I'm Mark Crossgrey, this is Business Life.